What is up guys? DJX and that's it. You are looking at a new walkthrough. Everyone not walkthrough, a playthrough that we're gonna do. So we are going to play through Pokemon or we're gonna revisit Pokemon Forest Sky. As you guys do know, I played through this before in a Nuzlocke that wasn't so successful. And they got cancer due to time constraints. But now I have a little bit more time. So we will try to uh, get most of it done. We'll try to complete it the best way we can. These jacks were here, honey. It must be tiring riding what our things in the moving truck. Well, this is small town. How do you like it? This is our new home. That's a quaint feel. It seems to be an easy place to live, don't you think? Oh, you get your own DJX. Let's go inside. See, DJX, isn't that nice in here too? The Bumper's Pokemon will do all the work of moving us and then cleaning up after. This is so convenient. DJX, your room is upstairs. Check it out, dear. I bought you a new clock tomorrow. I move here. Don't forget to set it. And there's our GameCube. Your boy advanced to connect to the. I never knew that. That's cool. The clock is stopped. You better set and start it. And I'm just gonna set it to a random time. To like 12 or something. You know, when I'm recording this, it's like 2. You have like a new room. Good, everything's put away nearby. They finished moving everything in downstairs too. Pokemon movers are so convenient. Oh, you should make sure that everything all there on your desk. Let's actually do we have a potion? Yep. No mail. And decoration. Okay then. Well, this time we'll try to get eight badges and since there's no extra rules, maybe we'll be able to beat the game. Maybe this time because we could get it on footage if my uh, expert doesn't mess up. Because I wasn't able to upload the finale of Forest Guy. Well, I'm going to have a proof video though for you guys to completely end it. Our report at the Pokemon League is over. Thanks for watching. Oh, it's over. We missed Champion Cynthia. Too bad. Oh, yes. One of my friends lives in town. Professor Birch is his name. He lives right next door, so you should go over and introduce yourself. Let me know my cursor. I apologize, guys. So we're gonna go right over to go see Professor Birch. And he's our neighbor, or at least his this his daughter's our neighbor. Oh hello, and you are? Oh, you do DJ, DJ's our new next door neighbor. Hi. We have a daughter about the same age as you. Our daughter was excited about making a new friend. Our daughter's upstairs, I think. She pretty sure she is. And this is ours. Huh? Who, who are you? Oh, you're DJX. You, so you move us today. Uh, I'm A. Glad, glad to meet you. I, I have this dream of becoming fans of Pokemon all over the world. I, I heard about you, DJX, from my dad, Professor Birch. I was hoping that you would be nice, DJX, and that we could be friends. Oh, this is silly, isn't it? I, I must have met you, DJX. <laughs> oh, no, I forgot. I was supposed to go help dad catch some wild Pokemon. DJX, I'll catch you later. I wish we could take it. She has the same game as us. That's nice. Is the TV on. And this is the Hoenn region. Or well, it was the Hoenn region. So it looks like we either go to Pure City first, or the other city south of us. I forgot the name. We have one too though. And if I'm right, the daycare is also in this town. Yeah. We don't have a starter, so it's no point.
he's going to go. I'm just in this road. Wait till I'm finished, okay? Okay. Oh, if you guys notice, I haven't been using speed up a lot because actually, this is going to sound stupid. I got like the speed up scan. It's like lagging and stuff. It's not lagging anymore though, so I'm glad. And I guess the professor is right over here. Oh, sorry, you can't go into the area yet. That's odd. Where can you be? Or where can. Yeah, where can you be? Are you still examining this road? Maybe he's. Uh oh. Mount Full Moon. Huh? This is. That's Cresselia, rare Pokemon. Mount Full Moon is her home. However, she is rarely here. Pokemon you see is only an illusion. If you're lucky, you'll see a real Cresselia. Ah, sorry, I haven't introduced myself yet. I'm Flash, a brilliant witch. Haha. <laughs> I must go now. See you again. Bye. Umbala. You shouldn't go outside when you don't have a Pokemon. I was looking for you, genius. Ah, uh, I'm Birch. Maybe you should have visited my house, didn't you? Hmm. You need to have a Pokemon. Luckily, I brought three Pokemon. Now you need to choose one. Ah, quickly, a lot of Pokemon appeared. Okay, so the last play, we obviously chose a water. I uh, chose a fire type char. It was a really good Pokemon for us. And this time, I'm gonna choose another fire type. Or I mean, because I already used Turtwig in my Nuzlocke. I don't want to use Piplup. I want to try something different. Because usually, whenever I play a Pokemon game, I usually choose the water type. It's a bad habit. I don't want to, but I just end up choosing it anyways. So we're gonna go ahead and use Chimchar. I don't have any fire moves yet. All right, about three HP. Good. Not that bad. Good start. Three again, and we will take it out. And we gain 17 experience points. Wow! Thanks a lot. Now we have to go back to my lab. Follow me. So, Ejects, I've heard so much about you from your brother. I've heard that you don't have your own Pokemon yet. By the way, you battled earlier. Wait, by the way, you battled earlier. You pulled up with the plump. Oh, yes. Thank you. Thank you, rest me. I'd like you to have Pokemon you used earlier. While you're at it, why not give a nickname to that gym draw? I will. I really don't have any names. How about oh no? I have to think for a second. This is gonna be kind of dumb because it's really basic. I'm just gonna name it Inferno. If you wanna work at Pokemon. In game experience, I think you make an extremely good trainer. My kid May is also studying Pokemon will help me out. DJX, why don't you think? Don't you think it might be a good idea to go see May? Great, May should be happy too. Get May to teach you what it means to be a trainer. What is this item over here? No, we can't get it. Okay. We all will enjoy the running shoes sooner or later. Just saying. What are you going to see? What are you? You know, where are we supposed to go? Unless we have to go through Mount Full Moon. Always fall for that. Whose house? Land's house. It doesn't seem like anybody's in here. Oh, here's somebody. Hi. If you get something, don't know what to do. Talk people, talk everyone you see, go wherever you can. You find many places by doing just that. Not really helpful, but okay. Maybe it's helpful for us now. 
Oh. We only have one Pokemon, so. And I guess it's through the cave we go. Mount Full Moon. Now it's been a while since I played this. I don't exactly know where to go. But I'm, I actually see two entrances. So, you know, let's go to the third one. Um, oh, hi you Jake. My dad gave you one degree. Now, try to be a trainer. Alright. Our uh, first battle versus May. She's gonna choose a Pokemon that is has the advantage over yours. We really didn't need to heal up. Let me just go ahead and rear. Oh, we had an orange berry sweet. Alright, we're now level 6. Wow, excellent. We got 1,040. Alright, that's not bad. Now, let's go back to my dad's place. I really don't want to, but we might not have a choice. Hi, I'm Scott. I'm in the assistant of Professor Birch. You just come here, right? Man, he's looking for you. Um, we should go meet her. Oh, okay. Is he still there or something? Yeah. Alright. And of course, you're gonna be right here. Hot May DJ's club. Come quick. Alright, so let's zoom all the way down. Oh, alright, DJ. I heard you beat May first try. That's excellent. May's been helping with my research for a long time. May has an extensive history as a trainer already. Here, DJ, I ordered this for my research, but I think you should have this Pokedex. Alright, so now we have the Pokedex. Pokedex is a high tech tool that automatically makes a record of any Pokemon you need to catch. My kid, May, goes everywhere with it. Whenever my kid catches the right Pokemon and records it, that in the Pokedex with my May looks for me while I'm out. Doing field work and shows me. Oh, wow, DJ, you got a Pokedex too. That's great. Just like me, I've got something for you too. Now that's nice. It's funny if you can get a lot of Pokemon. I'm going to look all over the place because I want different Pokemon. If I find any cute Pokemon, I'll catch them with Pokeballs. Alright, so in the next episode, we are going to continue our adventure and hopefully catch something. So thank you guys so much for watching the first episode of My Forest Guy Revisited Playthrough. I will see you all shortly. Peace.